Hey everyone, and welcome to the um, se seventh, seventh, seventh puppet show. And on today's show, I've decided that since there are three full characters, quote unquote, they're not really full characters anymore because my role has changed. But anyway, the three puppets that are remaining that have not shown up on this show, I thought I would show them to you guys today. So you guys, guys, so they can get a chance to shine. Shine. There we go. And so today, first off, here's. Hey, wait, hey, wait a minute. Stop, stop the puppet show. Stop. Wait, what, what, Larry, what are you doing here? Where's the prosecutor? Where's Edgy? What, what do you need a prosecutor for? I, my dog's got eaten. You, you're what? My samurai dogs, of course. Wait, you're working there again? Yeah. Um, but what are you. Why do you. Um, I'm playing. Because. Because I saw some, saw the guy who ate him, and I need to get him prosecuted. Um, okay. Do you mind telling me who this guy is? You know that little red guy. You mean Mayla? Yeah, that thing, the fuzzy thing. Um, okay then. Yeah, first Edgy. I'm gonna go find him right now. Um, uh, very well then. I guess instead we will figure out what's going on with that. Court is now in session for the trial of Mela. The defense is ready, Your Honor. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Ms. Von Karma? Again? But, but I thought Mr. Edwards was handling this case, wasn't he? Well, he was going to show up, but apparently he is very busy with some important matter. Well, hello, Miles Edwards. Hey! Hey, you leave him alone! Bye! And this is your excuse to have them both in the show, PFA? Yep. Regardless, I can handle the case in his place. Very well, then. Ms. Von Karma, your opening statement, please. Thank you, Your Honor. The defendant has been charged with a very serious crime. The crime of stealing and of eating Mr. Larry Butt's hot dogs. The th now, the prosecution is here to prove that the defendant did indeed do this deed and is guilty of a crime. Hmm. I see. Well, I personally think I would like to hear from the defendant, so if the defendant will please take the stand... Please state your name and occupation for the record of the court. Me, Mayla. All right, Mayla, do you understand the crime with which you have been charged? Maybe, yes. Maybe, yes. You sound very uncertain about yourself there, defendant. Well, well, maybe he just doesn't know why he's being charged with this cr crime. I mean, understanding why, he, what the crime is and understanding why he's being charged with it are two entirely different things, right? Um, yeah, I don't know if that really made sense, Nick. <laughs> Just never mind. So, tell me, do you confess to the crime? Ah, uh, yes. Well, there you have it, Mr. Phoenix Wright. Looks like this is a victory for Franziska von Karma. Objection! We have to prove that he didn't do it before we can make any decisions. Um, Mayla, can you please testify further? Hey, no. Wait, what? But, Mayla, but if you plead guilty, you know you're going to get arrested, right? Do you really want that? Ah, uh, yes. Don't you see, Mr. Phoenix Wright? The defendant clearly feels guilty about what he has done, and thus is confessing to the crime. Hold it, but we need to investigate this crime before we make any decisions. Please, let me just ask one question. Well, I'm all right with that. What about you, Mayla? What do you say? Whoopee! Yes. All right, um... Now I can't think of what I was supposed to ask him. This seemed like such a good idea at the time. Um, shoot. Think, Phoenix. Think! There's gotta be something. Maybe you need to think outside of the box for this one, Phoenix. Oh, Mia, what are you doing here? I'm here to help you. What? That's not fair! You shouldn't be able to get help from the deceased! Wait, what did you just say? Think outside of the box. Maybe there is some way you can ask him a question and you can find out whether or not he did the crime. I... Miles, what took you so long and why do you look so tired? I'm sorry, it's just... It's just... It was difficult getting here. It was kind of... You are going to die a most painful death! What? Ah! That's quite enough of that, Von Karma. You leave him alone. You! Um, okay then. Wait, wait, that's it. Thanks, Mia, you're a big help. No problem, Phoenix. All right, so, Mela, tell me one thing. 
You did eat Larry's cheeseburgers, correct? Mr. Wright, you do realize that it was... I see. So you thought that they sounded good, and thus you ate them. Big, no. But you did eat them, correct? Ah, big, yes. I see. Well, what do you know? It sounds like Mr. Phoenix Wright is conceding defeat at last. In that case, Nayla, you could not have eaten Larry's hot dogs. Wait, what? Mr. Phoenix Wright, what are you saying? Ms. Von Karma, I think you're aware that hot dogs and hamburgers are two very different things. So how could he possibly have confused the two if he really had eaten them? Of course, you, this is ridiculous. Why would he do something like that? Well, there has to be a reason. Wait, maybe... Wait, Mayla, can you tell me if somebody made you say that you ate Larry's hot dogs? Uh, Mayla, I believe that you have been manipulated into admitting a crime that you did not commit. Is this true? Me, Mayla, me, she, no. Hmm. Even if your claim was true, it's not like he's going to rat out his accomplice. Besides, Mr. Larry Butts claimed that he saw the defendant himself steal it, eating, stealing and eating the hot dogs. Why do you, how do you explain that? Well, uh, maybe it was just somebody who looked like Mayla. Objection! That's ridiculous! There's no one around here that looks like the defendant, so unless it was an illusion or something, that's impossible! Hmm. An illusion, you say? Wait, Mia, that's it! Maybe it was an illusion! I demand the crime scene be scanned for magic to see if there was any illusion magic performed there. What? That's ridiculous! Hey, wait, no, that's a great idea, pal. I'll go ask Kai if I can power her scanner. Well, I'm back with the results, but, um... All the hot dogs are still there. They weren't eaten at all. Wait, what? Um, but that doesn't make any sense. What in the name of foolish fools? But wait, Larry, then why did you claim that they were eaten if they weren't actually eaten? Hey, I don't know. I just swear they were eaten, but uh, I don't know. Maybe it was a dream or something. Well, that certainly changes things, doesn't it? But wait, then why did the defendant claim that he ate them in the first place? Well, perhaps somebody tricked him into saying it. I would say that it is most likely that someone decided that that pathetic creature deserved to die. Well, in that case, maybe it was you who did it. Um, Nick? <laughs> no, why would I do something like that? Yeah, um, I agree. I don't think that's really the kind of thing he does. But anyway, get out of here! Uh, you guys do realize that Mela is just an electronic toy and that his responses are randomized, right? Wait, really? But he was so convincing. Hmm, in that case, Mela, tell me one more time. Did you commit the crime? Very big, no. Well, that's good enough for me. This court finds the defendant, Mela, not guilty. What? This is ridiculous! You, you're an, uh... Yay, now we can go out for burgers! So how about you, Mela? You want to come with? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, true mom sounds very good. Alright then, I guess that's it. Thanks everyone for watching. And so there's the three new puppets I've told you. Did you see them? I bet you did, because they're probably kind of hard to miss. But anyway, I'm glad you enjoyed the show, or I hope you enjoyed the show. And until next time, we will have an even better show, for sure, because... Hey, wait a minute! Hey! What about me? Oh, um... Hi, Roan. What are you doing here? There's you forgot all about me. You added me to the role, and you haven't even done, done anything with me yet. So now you get a chance to shine too. Uh, sure, I guess. Hey, everyone, look, it's Roan. And yeah, what about those three other characters? You all don't. We'll get to them later, next show. Okay, whatever. Um. So yeah, bye, guys. Hi there, you guys. It's Lem.